Remember Martin Shkreli, arguably the most hated man in pharmaceuticals for raising the cost of a drug HIV patients regularly take by 5,000%? Well, he's getting some very unwanted attention again. Shkreli is the Turing Pharmaceuticals CEO who inflated the cost of the parasite-fighting and life-saving drug Daraprim from $13.50 to $750 a pill. Patients, the medical community, and the media blasted Shkreli for the move, and he eventually did say that he'd reverse the price increase. But on Wednesday, his company said in a press release that it would drop prices by 50% for hospitals, create smaller bottles with 30 pills, and provide free starter packs in 2016. The company also said, we pledge that no patient needing Daraprim will ever be denied access. Sounds nice, right? Well, these changes might only affect bulk buys, since it seems as if the $750 price per pill is unchanged, and compared to the $13.50 previous price, this is still massive. Shkreli previously said the company needed to increase the pill's price so it could do studies to improve the drug, but critics have questioned his company's ability to do sound scientific research. So I don't think this is a well-justified argument at all. Some presidential hopefuls have even used Shkreli and Turing as a part of their platforms for health care, or a conversation about how they could regulate the pharmaceutical industry to avoid price hikes like these in the future. For Newsy, I'm Cliff Judy.